Like I always say, Mr. Cabasai, if at first you don't succeed, build another park. Just when I think you've learned your lesson, you go and pull another stunt like this. And a thrill to be working with you again, my old friend. And Dr. Altus, I'm pleased to have you on board as well. I received glowing references from both Dr. Enteropus and Dr. Mongoliensis. I'm still not entirely certain why you sent for me after I had already returned home to Alberta. And why did you want me to bring along a das... A das... Huh. I seem to have cut you off before you said the thing I didn't want you to say in front of Mr. Cabazai, but for the life of me I can't think of a save. So, what made you decide to build a park devoted to the Carboniferous period? A dazzling disposition! You were wondering why I asked you to bring along a dazzling disposition! <laughs> yes, that's an adequate save. Oh, Carboniferous? Well, I figured, what could go wrong? Are you waiting for something? What could go wrong? Oh no, the Mega Neuro are loose! Run for your lives! Oh wait, never mind. It's safe. Huh, they're a lot less intimidating than I thought they would be. Oh, well, they do seem larger than normal insects. Well, I have to hand it to you. At least this one's gonna be an easy cleanup. But, well, wait! They still might wander too far and creep out the local populace. I don't think so. They appear to be disoriented outside of the oxygen dome. I guess they're having trouble adjusting to our modern atmosphere. After all, O2 levels were higher during the Carboniferous. All we really need are a few nets and we can round up the load of them. But, but, but where's the collateral damage? This isn't turning out anything like my previous ventures. Um, uh, release the Daspletosaurus. The what? Let me get this straight. You asked me to freight a Daspletosaurus across the ocean just so you could use it as a failsafe at one of your parks. Didn't fail? Well, when you say it like that, I just sound crazy. Oh, here comes the Daspletosaurus now. I bet it'll run amok. It's tame. What? I purchased her from an expert animal trainer. Look, your grandchildren are even riding it. Hi, Grandpa. Can I have one, Grandpa, please? Why do I feel as though I failed? Huh, if you'll excuse me, I think I have to go rethink my life. Huh.